Towards the run up to Christmas and all through the house, all the creatures were stuck. My diamond in the tree is silver and gold. So let me show you um, what it looks like with the light on. Okay, so I didn't get a topper, so I ended up putting those at the top of the tree. I used those last year and I stuck them everywhere inside the tree. But this year I decided to put them on top because I didn't want to use a topper. And um, I got these ornaments right here from the Dollar Tree. Um, this came from Walmart, got this last year. This was from Bitlock from last year. These came from Walmart. I think I saw these still this year. The ribbon that I I had already had this last year because I just put the gold on here. But I bought this ribbon right here from Walmart this year. Um, this came from Walmart. These letters I showed the one that I got in the haul for my daughter from Walmart. Um, this ornament right here, the silver and gold, I got that from probably Big Lots, I believe. That mirror Christmas stone, I believe I got that from um, Dollar Tree last year. So it's a repeat of ornaments on here. I got that silver flower right there from Big Lots. Um, the believe, I believe I got that either from Walmart or Dollar Tree. I can't remember, or Big Lots. Mostly this tree came from Big, everything on the tree came from Walmart, Big Lots, and, um, um, Walmart, Big Lots, and Dollar Tree is where I got most of my ornaments. The tree step came from Big Lots in the tree. This is a skinny tree that I have in here, which I thought it would be perfect for the dining room area. And that little crown right there, I got that from Walmart as well. And I put out some of the little ribbons. And you can see, like, I stuck it out. And let it stick out like that. I thought that would have been super cute. And I have the gold flowers right there. I got that from Big Lots as well. Um, yeah, I tried to pack everything I could on this tree. This is tree from... I got the skinny tree from Walmart last year. So I got rid of my, I have a huge muggish tree. And I just wanted to show y'all the tree in the dining room. I think it's really, really good.
So, to tell my YouTube people, she's extra. She, she wants all this extra stuff that I be having to go out and pay for. Oh, you have to pay for it? That we yeah. have to go out there and pay for. Yeah, he is. But she married me. And he married me. I just swipe the card. She the one gets whatever. Oh, that's why they got the card. Duh. Yeah, it it that part. <laughs> no, I'm keeping it in there. Okay, so this is what I have so far. I put that star on my skin tree last year because I told you it was still going to go. So I just put that up there to see how I like it. I'm not sure that I like it. I was thinking about putting bo a bow up there, but I don't know yet. And um, going down, this is a seven, not seven, six and a half foot block Christmas tree that I got from Walmart. It was $80. Um, I originally wanted to do a seven and a half foot one, but my husband picked this one up. So I said, this one will do. And once the Christmas tree is going to sell, I will be getting a seven and a half foot one because I sell them. It's just a little bit taller than what we thought. So it would be just right at seven and a half foot when when they go on sale, I will get another they come and get another flock one because I like the flock trees, um or whatever and I think it looks nice. Okay, so since I'm showing it to you, I got these little frosted branches right here. I don't know if you can okay, you can see. It looks really sparkly. I got these from Walmart. I stuck those up there and I'm thinking about getting some more of those. And probably some of the spiral glitter um sticks. Um and stick it up here. And I may leave that up there. I'm not sure yet. Um, I don't know. Okay, so I got this these two ribbons because I placed these two together. I got both of these from Big Lots. This one was seven because it was in a bigger row, and this one was three. And I got two of those. I got these ornaments right here from Big Lots. Um, I had posted these in a in my Big Lots Christmas haul that I picked up, and I got these from um, Dollar Tree, but I, I already had these a long time. So I just put them on here to make a like it's silver. The tree is silver and white, as you can see, with hints of 
do like the blues and things like that. And I'll show you my couch so that you can see why I chose those colors with the pillows that I have on there. Uh, I show this wooden letters right here in the hall. I show this Christmas tree ornament in the hall from Dollar Tree. Um, I already had these crystals right here for a long time that I got in the tree. Um, I'm trying to think what else. Um, I show all the ornaments, basically what I have on the tree. From big locks and all that in the hall. And I'll put an eye card up so that you can see it. Um, I got, I don't know if I show these, but these are pigs. This thing come in with the tree already. And I got these from Dollar Tree. And I thought they would make a good touch and put some a type of warmth to the tree. Um, and that's how I did it. I put those little stick things. I bought some more of those from the Dollar Tree. I put that in there. on the back that's the sh um decorate my fireplace um video i put that up as well show you how i did it but i didn't show me putting the um stockings on there and this year i used the command strips because all of the stocking holders were gone basically um so i just used what I had, and this is the fireplace. So I wanted to continue the white and the silver, but I added warmth to my garland, putting that burlap ribbon with the white lace. I think it gave it a nice touch, and it's still white and silver. It goes with the tree over here. Um, and I just used that ribbon because I had that sitting around at the house before I went about that ribbon that's on the tree. But I think it gives the fireplace a nice touch. And I put that picture in front. We have a speaker right here and you can see it. And we haven't mounted it up on the TV yet. So I just put the picture that's supposed to be in the middle. Y'all, my husband keep messing with stuff. He out, he all the time missing. But I guess he, cause you can't turn the speaker on cause it's blocked with still. Okay, so it's supposed to be like that and those are two um, candles. Uh, I think a while back in one of my other house, I showed that I bought a box of three candles, LED candles. Um, It comes with the remote and I got that from Big Lots and I, only got, I got it in a clearance of $5. So it had two on that side and they have a, a big one that sits in the middle. But I decided to put it on top of that and I like those up and the reindeer up as well. So I'm going to show you an overview of everything in the living room. Okay guys, here's an overview. I, as you can see, I bought these pillows from Ross. I did not haul these um, because they was the only thing I purchased because I wanted to change my living room up. I had yellow pillows on the couch because it came with the couch and I got caught looking in it. So I thought these pillows would be great. And you probably seen the sneak peek of it. <laughs> when I did my last haul because I was sitting inside two of them but um the flowers play off of that color and the light blue it play off of that light blue in this pillow um I wanted to get something to incorporate that and I feel like I still need some more of those flowers but 
these two pillows came from Ross, and I believe this one was on sale for $6.49. Um, they had reduced the price, and this one was, I think it was um, either $12.99 or $14.99, and I got two of each. This one I got from Gabe's, and it was only like $5, 5 or $6. I got two of those. I got that pillow for $12.99, and that one was for $12.99. That's the same silver pillow. And then there's the other two pillows. So I'm gonna sit back and give you an overview of everything. So this is the fireplace. No man, bro.